it's me it's constant here on youtube and facebook instagram so i am working on a lot of cards um trying to play catch up and next week i'm going to be working on the cruise layout and i'm going to put that video up from our cruise they're little tidbits of information of when i got to the islands and if you were on my personal page, you got to watch me get to the islands and go live in Jamaica and Grand Caymans. And, um, but I'm going to put all that in a video so you can see what I saw, including all the pictures. But just so you know, that's probably going to be an hour long. Um, but this video, I'm going to show you some cards. If you were watching on my Facebook page during Christmas and after Christmas, I was just doing cards. But I never finished them, and then some I started new. I have a few more here sent here to do. So I'm going to do these in like um, different videos to a point. There's going to be a miscellaneous card set. Um, but I'm going to try to do it in less videos as possible. This one is on Disney Princesses. Um, I had people over the years send me stuff. And I'm trying to work up what you all have given me. And I cannot tell you enough. I appreciate it. Um, I have a stockpile of cards. Um, I think it was last year or year before I ended up giving my mom 90 cards. She's like, sell them. I said, nobody buys my cards. I mean, I have people buy my cards, but I make so many. And I'm not out and about like I used to. Um, I did a craft show last year, but I'm going to make a lot of cards between now and the craft show. And I'm going to do another one. Anyway, I have two princess cards for you. And somebody had given me these um, probably four or five years ago. And I finally got around to using some of these. So this one is, both of them are called Happily Ever After with Disney Princesses. And I had taken this beautiful piece of paper that somebody gave me. They're actually like journal papers. On the back side is journaling and on the front side is imaging. Um, the journaling ones I'm going to save for um, layouts. Um, but I ended up using some Christmas, uh, or not Christmas wrap, some wrapping paper behind it. Because I think it looked really well with it. And I like to use different elements and different materials. And you're hearing water run because I just had a new water softener put in. And I'm running through the hot water so I can get hot, well it's not hot water, so that the hot water will fill up and cycle. But anyway, I took my favorite glitter glue. As a matter of fact, where's it at? I used... My stickles, of course. If you guys know me, I'm a glitter glue girl. Um, but I use this one stickle. This one's called Aqua. And then I use one of the three, usually, of like the icicle, the crystals on stickles. They're my favorite. So this one, um, both of the fronts are going to say happily ever after. One is one direction, one's the other. Um, it's different images, same image, but in different format. One's vertical, one's horizontal. One's got a thicker mat, one's got less. But it's... Uh, I glittered it the same way and I used the same type of colored paper on this one and I left them pretty much the same I did some circles and I left them simple because I always like to do scrap cards um, and when I get to some things and sometimes to me the scrap cards are the best cards because I don't think about it when I'm making a custom card I overthink it so it's pretty simple these are my cards for this video I'm gonna move on to the next so if you want to pop to the other one I try to make the videos as small as possible so, I hope you like the video. I hope you like these cute little Disney cards that I'm calling Happily Ever After. Um, semi-used for any occasion. So, thanks for watching. Enjoy the couple pictures behind us.